Hello friends subscribe my YouTube channel all PDR information and press the bell icon to never miss any updates from us. Reflection is the change in direction of the wave front and an interface between two different media so that the wave front returns into the medium from which it originated. Common examples include the reflection of light, sound and water waves. The law of reflection says that for specular reflection, the angle at which the wave is incident on the surface equals the angle at which it is reflected. Mirrors exhibit specular reflection. Reflection of light is either specular, mirror-like or diffuse retaining the energy, but losing the image depending on the nature of the interface. In specular reflection, the phase of the reflected waves depends on the choice of the origin of coordinates, but the relative phase between and T e and T m polarizations is fixed by the properties of the media and of the interface between them. A mirror provides the most common model for specular light reflection and typically consists of a glass sheet with a metallic coating where the significant reflection occurs. Reflection is enhanced in metals by suppression of wave propagation beyond their skin depths. Reflection also occurs at the surface of transparent media, such as water or glass. A mirror provides the most common model for specular light reflection and typically consists of a glass sheet with a metallic coating where the significant reflection occurs. Reflection is enhanced in metals by suppression of wave propagation beyond their skin depths. Reflection also occurs at the surface of transparent media, such as water or glass. In fact, limited reflection of light may occur whenever light travels from a medium of the given refractive index into a medium with a different refractive index. In the most general case, a certain fraction of the light is reflected from the interface and the remainder is refracted. Solving Maxwell's equations for the light by striking the boundary allows the derivation of the Fresnel equations which can be used to predict how much of the light is reflected and how much is refracted in a given situation. This is analogous to the way impedance mismatch in an electric circuit causes reflection of signals. Total internal reflection of light from the denser medium occurs if the angle of incidence is greater than the critical angle. Total internal reflection is used as a means of focusing waves that cannot effectively be reflected by common means. X-ray telescopes are constructed by creating a converging tunnel for the waves. As the waves interact at low angle with the surface of this tunnel, they are reflected toward the focus point or toward another interaction with the tunnel surface, eventually being directed to the detector at the focus. A conventional reflector would be useless as the X-rays would simply pass through the intended reflector. When light reflects of a material denser with higher refractive index than the external medium, it undergoes a polarity inversion. In contrast, a less dense, lower refractive index material will reflect light in phase. This is an important principle in the field of thin film optics.